to create the configuration policy using custom UI URI, we have to click on create profile and then under platform we have to select windows 10 and later and under profile type we have to select the templates and within templates we have to select the custom templates and then we have to create it and then we have to provide the name of the configuration profile and then we have to click on next and then we have to add the all the required OMA URI for the deployment. So the very first OMA URI is allow commercial data pipeline and under description also I am giving the same and within the OMA URI we have to provide the path of the OMA URI and the data type should be integer and the value should be 1 and then click on save now we have to add the next OMA URI and the name of the OMA URI is allow telemetry and under description I am just providing the same thing and under OMA URI we have to provide the path of the OMA URI and the data type should be integer and the value should be 1 then click on save now we have to add the third OMA URI which is allow update compliance processing under description I am just putting the same thing allow update compliance processing and uh, under OMA URI we have to provide the path of the OMA URI and then we have to select the data type the data type should be integer and the value should be 16 and then click on save then the fourth OMA URI we have to add is uh, disable telemetry opt-in interface and under description the same thing and then we have to add the path of OMA URI and the data type should be integer and the value should be 1 then save it and the last OMA URI is allow name in the diagnostic data and under OMA URI we have to provide the path of OMA URI and the data type should be integer and the value should be 1 and then save it then we have all the OMA URI required for monitoring is created and now we have to click on next and then we have to assign to the required devices for now I am adding all devices and then I am clicking next and then create and then finally review it and create and now we can see that the update compliance policy using OMA URI also created I hope this is an informative video for you thank you very much for watching this video